person profile, 70%, 80% they will ask me the code Java. Okay, so that's why we are spending more time on the code Java. So your 70% is, you know, you are ready for the interview. Selenium, you know, uh, not uh, too much stuff, right? Limited question is there. But Java having a, if you don't have a knowledge, good knowledge in the course Java, they will reject it in the technical round only. Okay. Okay, no problem. <coughs> Able to see my screen? Able to see, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So, we have a started test ng. Do you install in your system test ng? In the last session, I have given this. As steps. If you did not install, just configure this testing. Okay. So inside this <coughs> test ng, we have a you know different annotation. We have a at the red test. So where you can go there and test. And so you know only one guy is tested for <laughs> a day interviews okay Bipin. so he is very interested so he also you know if you will attend the demo interview you will get a lot of the stuff before going live so don't miss the demo interview if i will pin we have a demo interview so if you are not uh, you know like prepare and all leave it just attend you will get if you will go in this uh, test ng organization Inside this documentation, we have a documentation. There is this. I uh, will go in this documentation. So, we will go in this documentation. So, you can see we have a, <coughs> this, you know, this is called an annotation. But how to use this, where to use this all the annotation, we will learn. Okay? Why I am I am telling the documentation? So anyone is making the documentation, you are doing the practice. These very advanced people who made this testing. So they are not giving the proper. So you are not able to understand the one stuff. But I will try to make it simply. Then you can follow this documentation. Okay. After getting the time. You Explore your thing, all the document. This will help you. Okay, in the real time, uh, when you started the job, you can take also the help of this documentation. Okay, so we will discuss all the stuff. So, annotation we have a <coughs> at the red test before <coughs> method, after method, after class, before class before group after group before shoot after shoot so these are the annotation so how to use this annotation we will learn okay so what happened <coughs> when we are starting java right java programming so execution is just started from main method but in the test ng execution is just started from at the rate test okay in test ng execution is started from at the Okay, whenever we execute test ng classes, okay, so test ng always look for the add array test. When you made this class, okay, I made this test ng class. When the execution will start, so test ng will look for this add array test. When you are executing in the code Java, so what happened? Execution is just starting from main method. So same thing happened with test ng okay. <coughs> okay start from this in one test ng class you know multiple at a red test okay. so you have a one test ng class this is the one test ng class we have a multiple at a red test okay okay <coughs> okay so Test ng class name and method should be in with test a script as per coding a standard. Okay, what is the meaning of this? 
you can see this is your this is your add a test inside this we have a method so one at the rate test and you are learning first time it will not get come you know uh, clear 100% right now but we will execute some code so you will get it so like we have a 10 100 test cases so how to execute 100 test cases so one at the rate okay so you can see this is at the rate test and like this is the coding standard we have to follow our test case is one and your test case name is like login page tc01 so we will follow this you know one test cases according to the test case name okay so let us see with the, some code so we will get so that thing i have meant, mentioned test ng class name and method name should be in with test script A direct test method is used to implement actual annotation single test case means one a direct test is called single test case so theory lot of the thing is not able to clear but will come with coding you will get idea okay we have a before method and after method so this is the syntax of before method and after method so here one thing after method how to use this okay it must be one at one at test if you will not use this one test it won't be work okay so if you are using before method and after method then one test cases should be there okay sometimes what happened this is the interview question sometimes they can ask but why we are using this before method and after method we will learn this so you can see I'm not using right now the test case okay so you can see we have used and we have a one a direct test right this is I have method I, I have used only before method and after method I did not use any test means this is the test case one and test case two I am not using this let's see what will happen let me come with this okay okay you can see when I am not using a direct test, it is not coming test engine, right? Test engine. You can see. Okay. So when I am uncommenting this. Okay. Now I am now you can see this what I am going to say. If you are using before test, before method and after method, you, you must have one test cases. Otherwise, it won't be work. We have before method and after method. And I am going to execute. After executing, we will see what is happening. It will get clear. We are going to do this. But we are seeing this
so we we'll see this console you can see how it is executing now we are learning executing okay after that we will learn where we will use this before method and after method. so execution first you can see before method is executed and first test is executed then after so you can see again before method is executed second test case is executed and after method is execution so if you having the 10 test cases again before method will be executed then again test case will be executed after method will be executed okay so we are seeing now how it is before method and after method and at the red test now you have any doubt regarding for execution of this I am not discussing where we will use before method and after method. Now I am going to tell how executing. Okay. So I have a one example. So coming example we will see where we will use this. Like we have a one example. Like this is your test cases. Okay. We have a test case. This is a project and customer. So we have a one test case create a customer. So after creating the customer, we have to launch the browser. We have to log in the page again, create the customer and log out and close this. So this is your steps of the test cases. We have another test case customer. So modification may sorry in modification. What will happen? We are launching this browser, logging this app. Okay, log at this and close this browser. So, here we are doing the modification. Let's see in this uh, project and customer. So, where is this project? So, this example, <coughs> who is this? Unable to see your screen. I did not see my screen. I just my screen, right? Others people are others. Yes. Okay. Video again. If you having the issue, you can ask me. Okay. We have a one more example. So we can see in this example we have a before method. In this uh, before method, what you have to do? I'm doing here. What you have to do inside this before method? Here, what I am going to do? Here, I am going to create a customer and verify the customer. I can do one example like we have an example of HDFC banking. So, what do you have to do? We have a register, right? So same, this is the dummy example. I am showing where you have to use this. Okay. So, create a and register this login page so all the steps are there test steps so this is you, you can write inside this at direct test and verify the customer if you want the customer then you have to verify the customer customer is created you know customer is created or not yeah you can take the simple example i'm going to register the page and i'm going to verify if i register, register the page if i 
able to log in or opt. So this is your second test cases. So these are steps you have to write this. Again, this is the again second test cases. What is the second test cases? Here, this is the first test cases and this is the second test cases. I have printed. I am not writing here any test a script. And after that, inside after method, what you have to do? After method, what I have, I have log out this page and close the browser. Now, you will tell me out regarding this before method and after method. Where you will use the before method? Where you will So you can see how it is the browser and log in the application. After that, create the customer and verify. One test case is completed here. Okay. Again, here one test case is completed. First, what is happening? It is launching the browser and log in the Create the customer and verify the customer. Again, log out the customer and close the browser. One test case is over. Again, second test case. Again, it will launch the browser and log in the app. Create, modify the customer and again, log out and close the browser. So, how this is the before method and after method is working. Okay. So, you can see this test case 2 is okay. like that you can see. Okay. Here you can also see. So, before method and after method, okay. I will give you the theory also. before will be executed before executing each test method in the class. Before executing, right? Before uh, test cases, it is and after method and after method will be executed after executing each test case. Of before and after before means it will be executed before test case after means it will be executed after test case right? means we have created a customer but before what is happening launch the browser and log in the application after means log out the application and close the browser. so this is you know how it is working in order to insert test cases we, we will go for the before uh, and after annotation method so okay not worry about this point okay so before and after annotation method only which cannot be executed without that direct test okay that's why i i was showing right if you will not use at a test so before and after so one another annotation is called before class and after class so it will execute only once in the entire class you can see when we are using this before and after so it will execute you know like we have five, times, so it will execute five times right before after before after before after it will execute five times before class and after class, it will execute only 
ones so this is the before method and before class before uh, after method and after class so it will execute only once in the entire class execution before executing the first annotation method in the class okay so all the idea about this okay so we have an example of this so before the class another class will be used for the global configuration so where you will use this before the class so global configuration means launch the you know browser object so what happened why we will launch again and again browser right we have a hundred test cases and we have hundred times so right we will only launch only one times of the browser so that is then the before method any initialization is there like variable initialization anything then this is a before class and after class okay so which will be executed only once in the entire class so this is the difference between uh, before method and before class method and after class okay so we see an example we have another annotation called before shoot and after shoot so before shoot means shoot means multiple test cases we have a multiple test cases is called shoot collection of the test cases is called shoot so what is the meaning of shoot so how to execute this so you know shoot like you can use by using the xml file so you have a thousand test cases and you are executing thousand test cases at at once that is called shoot okay how to achieve this shoot so by using this xml file i will also come with okay so before shoot so this method is executed before executing all the test cases for the shoot shoot means where it is present inside this xml file okay after shoot means After executing all the test cases present in the suit, so this is all the steps. So don't worry, we'll use in this script that you guys will understand. So how to achieve this? Executing the before suit and after suit will be executed in the exact way. Otherwise, after suit will not work. Okay, so before suit or after suit. and we will use you know okay. so execution flow what is the execution flow of all the stuff so this is okay they will ask what is the how they are executing all the test uh, what is the test case uh, this is the execution flow of annotation so execution Okay. okay that you know uh up to shoot we can achieve by this xml file okay. like we Post and after post, but we are seeing the execution flow of all the annotation. Like we have a this uh, uh, what we can say? Not this. Like we are using this test cases here, right? XML. When I will, uh, you know, I can this XML stuff. Post 
because we have to explain all the we have a suit name and all okay so we will come in classes i will tell you how to use it okay so first we will learn this Okay. Okay. So, Sorry. yeah, yeah. But they are very frequently this after shoot and before shoot. But sometimes we have a big frame work, like you know, like two thousand. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, no, how you are uh, like like right now? Um, first completed only three days and so first uh, um logging. No, 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 actually no. Okay. Hello. Yes, 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 yes. XML file. Tushan, I get the three. Uh, the using. I initialize. Okay. Okay. All that stuff, all that stuff I will discuss parallel and division cross border testing and. Okay. okay. Why? Because <laughs> I don't know how it is yeah, complicated. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Confused. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. A lot of the people are new in the selenium. So it is, you know, what is the selenium? No, everything is part. Okay. That we have to consolidate in a one framework. That is called framework. Called only framework, right? So you are learning test engine, you are learning XML file, you are learning basic selenium. So what is the meaning of framework? Means it, it like you know, you make the task easy. We have a complicated task, right? So we have to make the task easy. So we have multiple way to design the framework, right? So what the client is looking right now? The client is looking. I you guys uh, spend less time and I want the more productivity. Okay, so this is what the client wants. Okay. So we will discuss, okay. <laughs> what is the interview question? No, you can see in this example you here one test cases, second test cases. Before class, after class, before test, after test, before class, after shoot. So they can ask, they will give you and ask how Okay. So this is the just execute one times and two times you are able to how this is the and they give you the scenario. Okay, so we will see this output. Okay, so how it is executed. Then after that, executing the report test, the report class before method, then it is executing the first test case. So this we have Okay, again, this test cases is one. 
now after executing method before method again this is after method and after class and after test but they will not ask to executing in the last of this after shoot so what you have to do just execute remember this so they can ask they will not ask like too much complicated but they can ask before method if before method is there before shoot met suit is there then will be understood right so that's it not a big deal yes. this is your simple execution flow of all the annotation okay <coughs> so how to test it in the xml file automatically okay so what do you have to do So how to create this XML file? Select all the package. Okay, I'm taking uh, another one. Okay, but it is not. Okay. So what I have to like do? The yes, yes, yes. Okay. So now I'm not. Uh, this one. Okay. So now we select this package. Test ng and convert to now. You can give here any name. Samal test ng give any name. Okay, like new new. Just I am giving any name. Okay, you can give any name from here. Okay, now I am going to. It's a. this thing you can see uh, so all this you can execute all this like this whatever it is in this one 